This is the ML8 deficient mice. They are more uh, restless compared to the normal mice. The neurotransmitter serotonin, dopamine, norepinephrine are increased and they have abnormal behavior. Their movement is abnormal. And most obvious behavior is that they are very aggressive. So we hope to develop some drug that can reduce the aggressive behavior. We first study in the mice and then hopefully can also apply to human. See, we put the serotonin antagonists, serotonin receptor antagonist into the mice. So block the serotonin receptor. And you see these two mice, they don't fight anymore. When they are together, they become friendly sniffing instead of fighting. Another approach is if you could use gene therapy because in these mice, uh, MLA gene is not there. So you can deliver the gene into certain region, for example, in the brain, and maybe you can also reverse the aggressive behavior. At this point, there are still many te technology difficulty in gene therapy, but many people are working towards that goal. Hopefully, in the future, we'll be able to use gene therapy. But immediately, with these animal available, we can just use the pharmacological agent to reverse the behavior. This is just so exciting. That's why uh, with the gene knockout animal, it's fascinating. You have one model for the first time. They are fighting so aggressively, and then we can develop drug to treat them. And this is an excellent model, help you to find the drug.